So in previous lecture, uh, we studied about safety and security, clear about smart safety. So in this lecture, we discuss about cyber security as well as disaster management in smart safety. So what is the meaning of cyber security? So you know that what is the means of cyber security here? So it relates to the practice of defending computer servers, computers, servers, mobile devices, electronic systems, networks and data from malicious attacks. Here it is known as the information technology security or electronic information security. Defend various devices from malicious attacks that known that called as a cyber security. Yeah. So this type of term which is applied in various types of contracts from business to mobile computing and can be divided into few common categories. Clear? Yeah. So like this. Uh, first category will be that network and security. So Network in security, it means it is the practice of security uh, computer network from intruder, whether the target and attacks, attackers or opportunistic malware. Means network security, it, it is one type of practice and secure a computer network from uh, the attackers, intruders. Here, yeah, that call known as a network security. Well, so the next one is application security. So, that focus on keeping software and devices free of that. Here, yeah. you know that in your phone, uh, you use various types of applications which prevent from the viruses. Here, yeah. so that application is known as an application security. Here, yeah. Their successful security begins in the design stage well before a program or device is deployed. Here, yeah. like uh, X company deploy of one fold here. Yeah. So at that uh, time of design, they secure that all of the applications. Yeah. And like iPhone, iPhone was the uh, highest security feature for Apple. All over the world. Yeah. So the next third one information security. So it protects from the it protects the integrity and the privacy of data. Clear yeah. both storage as well as transit means transfer. Clear yeah. that called information security. The next one that known as operational security. So in operational security, it includes the process and decision for handling and protecting the data aside. Here, yeah. so operational security handles and protect the data aside. So, the permission user when accessing the network, the procedure and determine how and where data may be stored or shared all four under this umbrella. Means operational security. It includes process and design and decision for handling and protecting data assets. Here, so this the application user while assessing a net. So at that time, the processor determine how and where the data may be stored. So that all things which are uh, which included in operational security. Next one, disaster recovery and business continuity. So, define how organizations respond to cyber security incident or any other event causes the loss of operation or data. Clear? The next one, end user education. So, end user education. Addresses the most unpredictable cyber security factor that uh, most people, which anyone can accidentally introduce a virus or other by the secure system by 
failing to follow good security parties uh, practices clear so this all thing which is your end user education clear so teaching user to delete suspicious email attachment and not log on identified usb drives and various other important relation is a vital for the security of any organization here so this all things which is including end user education the next one when these adverse of threat clear is that are counted by cyber security which is three four these three first one cyber crime clear so that cyber crime includes single actors or groups targeting system for financial gain or post user clear so in cyber crime that is single actor or with groups here in you know that uh, in phone there are various types of groups here uh, we target company of very renowned like a coca cola microsoft and youtube here for that financial purpose and or to create unwashed situation here the second one cyber attack so cyber attack often involves politically motivated information gathering so cyber attacks done by what so it motivated information gathering for political cyber terrorism so it is intended to undermine the electronic system to cause panic or fear here so this attacks create for the causes for create for panic and or fear between the people so there are some common methods to threaten cyber security first one malware so malware means malicious software here this is one of the most common cyber threats malware is software that cyber criminal or hacker has created disrupt or damage legitimate user computer here there are numbers of different types of malware include first one that called virus here it is a self replicating uh, replicating program that attacks that attach itself to clean file and spread through the computer system and infecting file with a malicious code that called virus here the trojans this is a type of malware that is a discussed or like email software cyber criminal tricks Uploading trojans onto the computer where they cause damage or collect data. <laughs> that third one that called spyware, clear? So it is one type of program which is secretly record what user do in their computer system, clear? So spyware is uh, used for to capture credit and Credit debit card details clear. Then ransomware. You know that the ransomware. Clear. So you know uh, you heard name in YouTube two or three years ago ransomware, which locks down user file and data with a threat erasing unless ransom is paid. Clear means that uh, virus. Affected through throughout your computer, clear, and the all data will be gone. When you will pay that particular uh, people or that particular criminal, so that file will be open after that. The advert. So advert is a software which can be used to spread malware. What next? So network of malware infected computer which cyber criminal used to perform tasks on it without. So, what net is used, which used for your all systems used by another person in that computer. Second one that called SQL injection. 
clear as well means structural language required structural language required so it's a type of cyber attack used to attack control of and steal data from database so this type of attack used for to steal data from your database clear the next one is in phishing is where the cyber criminal target the victims with the emails that appear to be for legitimate company asking for sensitive information at that time the phishing is used for cyber security attack clear the third one so fourth one man the middle attack is a type of cyber threat where a cyber a cyber criminal intercept communications between two individuals in order to steal data here so at that time man in the middle attack means that person which is uh, intercept the communications between two individuals so that's why we call man in the middle attack. Dynamical, sorry, dynamical of service attack. So it means to prevent a computer system from fulfilling legitimate request by overwhelming the network and so with the traffic. That's why DOS, platform that we call a DOS, are used for that purpose. Then, so next topic is cyber security tools. Or protect yourself yourself against cyber attack. First one, update your software and operating system. This means you benefit from the last day security patches. This go. Use antivirus software. So you know that there are various types of antivirus softwares out there. Here in my cafe, uh, like that. Then the total security will detect and remove the threat. Keep your software, software updated for the best level of protection. Use strong password. We already discussed that. Then, fourth, do not open mail, email attachment from unknown sender. This could be infected with malware. Do not click on links, emails from unknown senders or unfamiliar website. Here, yeah. so this is a common method or path that malware is spread. Then, avoid using unsecure Wi Fi network in public places. Like uh, in public places, you got uh, free Wi Fi without password. So please do not use because this is a uh, one type of spreading of virus or spreading of malware. 